Hey guys, how are you? I hope you are doing good and welcome back to another video. It's Fahad from Motovoid.com and today I am back with another amazing custom ROM for our Redmi Note 11 users. This is the CR Droid 9.1 official build for our Redmi Note 11. As you can see here, the CR Droid version is 9.1 and it is based on Android 13. Security patch of this ROM is also pretty much latest, 5 January 2022. So the ROM is pretty much stable and it is official from CR Droid. So in this video I will be showing you its full review, Geekbench results and is it stable for daily usage and I will also tell you how you can install it on your Redmi Note 11. So without any further ado, let's get started. So first of all, let me show you its app opening speed. As you can see here the app opening speed is pretty much smooth. The animations are also played very well and if we talk about the camera, again we get the simple camera but this time we have the ultra wide option right here. So you can use the ultra wide and 1x uh, modes right here. You can simply capture the normal photos and take normal videos. You can also scan the documents. But if you want more features like portrait mode and advanced slow motion and other video modes, then you can go for a Gcam mode from Google. So other than that, everything is just working fine. The Bluetooth is working, Wi-Fi, mobile data, every single thing is working fine in this room. There is no any single bug or issue in this room. So here we also have the game space right here. So that's when you can do gaming on it. And uh, by the way, we don't get a lot of junky applications pre-installed. We get the audio effects right here to increase the sounding quality. So from left, you can access the Google feed. And if we talk about the home screen, here we have the typical settings. Like you can manage the icons, home screen, app drawer, recents. You can also enable some quick actions. And you can also use the uh, hidden and protected applications to protect or hide your applications. No need to download any third party app locker. So these are this features of home screen. So now let's go to the settings and have a look on the uh, customizations we have. So the quick settings looks like this typical Android 13 look. So you can edit the shortcuts right from here. A lot of shortcuts are available to, uh, to be used. As you can see here, always on display is also right here and it is working fine. So in the settings, first of all, we have the connectivity options, apps, notification, battery. And in the battery, uh, the battery backup of this ROM is also pretty much good because this is an official CR Droid ROM. So here we have battery usage, battery saver. We don't have the extreme battery saver right here. And some other options like battery optimization, then you can note the other battery options like temperature and capacity ETC. Then we have storage, sound and vibration. And here we don't have the Dolby Atmos because we get the audio effects right in the applications. And we also don't have any uh, sound enhancing technology in this room. So after it, here we have display option. In the display, you can simply enable the night light and you can also change its intensity as well and after it here we have live display color profiles are available as well rotation settings and smooth display option is also available which will automatically raise the refresh rate from 60 to 90 hertz for some content like scrolling on social media or while playing games but we don't have any option to enable or set the minimum or maximum refresh rate in this row then we have tap to wake, tap to sleep and app refresh rate. Then we have wallpaper and style. From here you can change the wallpaper. And if you want this wallpaper, the download link of this wallpaper is in the description box. Then you can change the wallpaper color. You can enable dark theme. You can also uh, enable themed icons, which will look like this. And you can also enable themes icon for the drawer as well. So then you can change the app grid. After it, here we have accessibility, security. And if you talk about the security, in the security, we have all security options like screen locks are working, face unlock and fingerprint can be used for security reasons as well. As you can see here, no, no need to be worried about the security. Then we have privacy, location, safety and emergency, Google, C Android settings and here we have all available customizations. First of all, we have the customizations for the status bar, status bar icons, network indicator and other icon settings as well. You can also enable or disable the logo which will right here you can change its position and you can also change the style from here so 
this one is looking good you can change the battery style battery percentage battery bar tap to sleep and you can also control the brightness over the uh, status bar then we have quick settings lock screen settings and uh, you can also maybe advanced reboot is also available right here so then we have navigation bar settings right here then we have button settings and here we have uh, volume button and power button settings then we have user interface from here you can enable or disable the uh, ambient display and uh, edge lighting is also available charging animation and uh, here we have smart pixels which can be useful to reduce power consumption then we have uh, screen of animations monet settings you can set up any color you can use any custom color as well after it here we have navbar style phone styles you can change the phone style for the rom let's try samsung one and let's see how it is looking so it just looks good on this rom then we have a uh, clock phone style for the lock screen maybe try this one so it looks like this these features are really cool then we have signal icon style wi-fi icon style uh, and icon shapes are also available then we have notification settings sound settings in color vibrations and in the misc you can use the game space and you can also unlock the higher fps in games to get ultra smoothness and you can also enable unlimited photo storage and you can do the netflix spoof as well and parallel space option is also available in this rom then we have smart charging swipe three finger for screenshot then you can read about the cr droid after it here we have system in the system we have languages and input system profiles gestures in the gesture we have quickly open camera system navigation bar one handed mode you can simply operate the whole screen by using only one hand then we have press and hold power button prevent ringing and then we have date and time backup updater and uh, if we get any update in future you can simply download the update right from this option because this is the official rom then we have multiple users and reset options now let me show you the geekbench results of this rom so it just scored uh, 380 on single core and it scored 1562 on multi cores the scores on multi core is pretty much impressive on this row in the bout phone you can check your android version which is android 13 cr android version is 9.1 and uh, its security patch is also all the way latest 5 january 2022 so this rom is uh, really clean and smooth and yes you can use it as your daily driver and uh, if you want to use this rom as your daily driver then you just need to download the rom from the link in the description and you can also follow the installation instructions from that same link this was the video for today i hope you guys like this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel keep supporting thanks for watching peace